that was us. Working long days in the big city. Late trains. Tall buildings. Crowds of people. So many people. But we'd always come home to the countryside, you know, back to the canals. And I remember one night, feeding the ducks. I was just slinging them bags of hovis. Bags and bags of it. They were going mad for it. And I think I came home that night, and it was, wasn't it? I, it was as simple as I turned to you and said, I want to build a cafe boat. You want to see You want So, as you saw, everything got pretty dusty and everything from outside came in. So we're going to just start sorting through it, getting rid of the stuff that's complete rubbish, like obviously all this paper stuff, and then maybe sorting through some of the wood. cleared this bit which like how much better does that look a million times better i mean don't look out yeah. here don't look out there that looks quite big doesn't it yeah it does it was quite a big deal with the sink because of health and safety and all that stuff so we have to have two sinks plus a hand washing sink all in the kitchen space in the food prep space so we needed something that was quite small but also had two compartments so this is the one that we found what do you reckon? Because mm. we'll have a little hob there. Yeah. Is that is this the best way to do the kitchen for the stuff? What do you think of today's efforts? I think brilliant. I didn't know it would get that clean today. Slash, I didn't want to bother. I wanted to have a nap after all this time. <laughs> but it's good that we've got that done. Yeah. So tomorrow, work can begin in earnest. <laughs> Not again. Yeah. No. Good morning. <laughs> You're joining us on the slowest canoe we've ever done. The weed, the duckweed has taken over the canal, so it might look like we're just canoeing on grass, but it's really heavy, thick weed. This looks new. Yeah, this whole box looks new. Yeah, I needed it. I needed a bigger socket set. You can't move for socket sets in here. That's a whole cutting set. You can't move for sets. <laughs> <laughs> How high are normal cabinets? There's so many elements that need to come together that we need to get from separate places. Yeah. And I find these things impossible to imagine. Like to... Uh, I just think that there's there's too many things that need to be right, like the, the measurements, like where the cabinets will fit under the gunnel thing 
and too many precise, I don't do well with precise measurements. When things have to be precise, it really stresses me out. <laughs> but basically what we're thinking is, coffee machine will be here. Fridge, grinder, so it's gonna go along there. So it goes to there. Just overlapping the side hatch a little bit. Hand sink, hob, 90 centimeters and cabinets. Stainless steel, 180. 50. 60. If this comes out to 60, stainless steel. Because stainless steel, stainless steel has a lip, because that won't be standard. Because we've got the boat safety certificate and just the general boat design and environmental health to please. So I kind of can't wait. I can't wait to order it and get it in. Yeah, it'll be fine. Love it. Do you want me to put? Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> wow. Bye, we did. Oh. Good morning. Today is a bit of a different one. It's an early start. Vic's been over at um, Holly since he got up about. We got up about six o'clock. He went straight over to Holly. I think we're just both feeling the urgency of this now. So I'm off to into Nottingham. I'm gonna rent a car pick up the kitchen units that we ordered last night. One train ride, one tram ride, one car ride later, and we're here. Dunna! Oh, I don't think you can see it actually. We're at B&Q, picking up the kitchen. Pretty good uh, camera arrangement for the canoe actually this. I've just come back to get the camera. So I've got a few things to catch you up on. Hiya, yeah, you're right. Hiya, yeah, you're right. We've got kitchen units going in as we speak. Joe's parents are here helping out. Joanna's mum currently uh, giving the outside of the boat a little clean. Our director's kicking off. <laughs> Dad's trying to start laying the floor, but Mum's like, you've got to wait for the pick. You're free to start. Let's go see inside as it is now. Mum's cleaning windows. Looks really good. <laughs> it's a logistical nightmare because we've got so much stuff in the boat still. Smooth, smooth. So we've got about as far as we can with the flooring, but I feel like we've accomplished a lot today. Looks like a real kitchen. Now we're just going to clean up this load and then head home. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and see if we make it in the end. <laughs>